Hi everybody, today I'm going to be doing another haul video. I actually went to Bath and Body Works again, only this time I went in Oshkosh because I think instead of just boycotting Bath and Body Works altogether, I'm just going to boycott the Appleton store for a little while and stick with my Oshkosh store. Um, at that outlet store, there are people there that work there that are so super nice, and I have absolutely no problems with any of them, so I'm going to stick to that one. And also, I myself, instead of my daughter, went to Yankee Candle, and I got 12 more votives. Um, so I'm going to share those with you guys. I'm going to do the Yankee Candles first. So... The first votive that I got, and again, this is at the outlet store, and usually at the regular store they have a deal going on right now where it's 10 votives for $10, but at my store it's 12 votives for $10, and needless to say they do not have the holiday votives, but they have all the other ones, and it's a pretty good selection. So the first one that I got was Ocean Breeze. It's a beautiful powder blue. The next one I got was Moonlight Harvest. It's in a beautiful purple. And this is a repurchase. I got Pink Blush. I absolutely love this one. I have it burning in my bathroom right now and my whole bathroom and into my hallway smell beautiful. It actually reminds me of the way my grandma's house used to smell when I would walk in there. Um, it would just smell like girl powder mixed in with some type of perfume smell but it's very light and delicate and that's what it smells like. It's really pretty. The next one is just plain cherry. We love a good cherry smell. The next one is mountain berry. And this next one is good air. It's an odor eliminating. It's called just plain clean. And this really isn't like a cotton smell. It's hard to describe, but it is not cotton whatsoever. You would think it would be, or like a laundry detergent, but it's not. It's it's a really good smell, and if I could find a large candle in this, I would probably get it, because it, it almost smells like if you were doing laundry outside, and then you open, or doing laundry, and like, you know how sometimes the vents open outside, and then like when you're outside, you can smell, oh, someone's doing laundry, that's kind of what it smells like, like a fresh breeze mixed in with like a beautiful floral clean laundry soap it's really pretty the next one that i got is lavender spa beautiful it smells like creamy vanilla lavender the next one is apple pear and again these are all for my bathroom oh these are really strong too like, considering that the plastic is still over these, I can smell all of these through the plastic, which is really good. Um, kiwi berries. Smells so good. The next one is Island Guava. I probably should pick up more of these because I love guava. Guava is like my staple smell like I I don't know I just love guava so much it's so good the second to last one is a soft cotton smells just like cotton and the last one is um beach flowers this is like a pretty lavender color smells so good so like you kind of have to hee-haw around the store um like the one that I noticed this beach flowers it is a la like a light lavender color but some of the other ones in the box they were miscolored on the top so you kind of have to like look around you have to make sure and actually smell the candles before you put them in your cart because one candle with the same name might not have a strong fragrance like the candle sitting next to it 
So you really have to smell. Another thing that happened to me is I broke the register down because one of the candles in here, I can't remember which one it was, was from, the guy said that it was from England. And I guess it made its way to the United States and decided to end up in my cart. So I don't know what happened. But that was really weird. So all those candles were $10. Um, again, they have their large jar candles, six for $60, which is a really good deal, which I am like highly considering doing maybe to get three for myself and then three as gifts because they are absolutely divine and they're really huge and that's a really good deal because originally they're like 30 bucks. So next is Bath and Body Works. Again, I went to the outlet, so these candles that you're going to be seeing are not offered at the regular store. I used two coupons. Yes, two coupons. Um, usually you can't double up on coupons, but I actually found a coupon where it said on the back that you could. So it was a coupon for buy any item in the store, it doesn't matter how much it is, any item, and get um, a signature fragrance item, $12 or less. So um, I ended up getting three candles um, that were 50% off already, so $10 each, 30 and then I also put another coupon towards that, $10 off of a $30 purchase. So I got three candles plus my signature, um, I got triple moisturizing cream for $20 really good deal. So the first I um, was is my triple moisturizing cream, which it doesn't say triple moisturizing cream on it. It just says body cream because this is the old packaging because remember I was at the outlet and I got my staple Juniper Breeze. This cream used to be like the whole line of Juniper Breeze used to be my signature fragrance in high school, in my 20s, and then kind of in my 30s. I just I don't know why I think the kids just I was busy with the kids and I kind of forgot about Bath and Body Works and didn't really buy from them um, so I kind of got away from it but now I just it just reminds me of so much I just I love my Juniper Breeze so I got that for free and then the candle that I got um, all these are the 14 point five ounce on the Slatkin and Company. I got Raspberry Sun Tea. And this one smells awesome. Oh, it's so good. It says refreshingly bright and fruity, a delicious blend of Darjingly tea, sugared raspberries, and juicy peach. And this candle is like juicy, juicy. It smells so good. And then the next one I got is called Lemon Mint, Lemon Mint Leaf. And this one reads on the bottom, an organic cultivation of bright lemon balm and fresh farm green spearmint. Oh, it's so good. It Like the mint overpowers the lemon, so you get like this explosion of mint and then like lemon notes afterwards. And it is so so refreshing and so good and then this one this one is called white sand and this one reads on the bottom like the first long days of summer at the beach sparkling grapefruit and sandalwood with coconut milk and summer jasmine so i remember when my kids were little there was a man-made beach that was really really close by that we used to go to it was like 50 cents to get in every summer and we would go there at least once a week when the kids were little and this reminds me this smell reminds me of that completely I can smell the sand I can smell the scent of the like not lake and not really ocean but just like the water because when you think of lake, you think of like dirty lake, but it it's not that at all. It's so refreshing. And I smell the sand and I do, I mean, the picture on it says everything. Like I do think of white sand castles. It's just an amazing smell. So you might be asking, why am I buying these candles when it's winter? Okay, well, I have all of the winter candles. I have like, I shouldn't say that. 
I have the majority of the winter candles and um, fall candles that they have out right now. The reason why I'm getting these is because these were only $10. I know usually I wait for these to go on 75% off, but I did have a coupon, so it really wasn't that bad. Um, but I kind of want to make sure that I have stock come spring come summer before the new stuff comes out because I'm not real sure if I'm going to like the new stuff. Like the, this winter stuff came out, the winter candles, and I'm not too impressed. They've done better. I think they've done better in years past. Um, but like these scents, like the raspberry tea and like the um, lemon mint leaf like this stuff is awesome and I love lighting these in my room anyway even in the winter time so this is going to be um, a must I might even go back and get more hopefully they'll be going 75% off but it's funny because when at first when I saw these at my outlet store they were um, the 50% off and there was like bunches and bunches of them like this whole wall was like just covered now I went and they have like this little display and that's it so they're selling and um they probably won't be going 75% off but that's okay so thank you guys so much for watching my haul please comment rate and subscribe down below and don't forget to thumbs up bye